Hey guys, Shucky here bringing guys another Pokemon video. This is actually the Monotype Tournament. We have Fairies from Mr. Fant or Lieutenant Fantastic, which is uh, Vin. And then we have Normal from Brandon, as we saw last round. Uh, Vin actually had the buy last round, so you didn't see anything from him. But um, I actually made his whole team, pretty much, and actually taught him how to use said team. So uh, he, he knows the strats, he knows the, the things to do, so... Um, Definitely, he, he worked hard on getting this going, and uh, yeah, hopefully this will be a good match. And uh, it looks like Brandon's actually starting off with the Zangoose, and uh, Vin is actually starting off with his Gardevoir here, so that's pretty interesting. Gardevoir, of course, has that, that Focus Blast, so it's going to be good against any of Brandon's Pokemon. Brandon does not have a Flying, so... Um, pretty interesting okay there's the zangoose was it was it uh shiny last time I, I mean it doesn't really matter if it has the same stuff it doesn't like i said it doesn't matter so he's gonna go with the protect that that's going to stop this focus blast from hitting and vid's probably crossing his fingers going hey please hit with this next one now that zangoose knows what's going on zangoose just wants to get that poison so it has a 15 percent 50 percent increased attack the Focus Blast is going to hit. There's no way Zangoose is actually surviving that. So down goes Zangoose. Gardevoir is one up. So here comes Chinchino. This thing, as we saw in the last round, is pretty house. Oh, Vin's going to actually miss the Focus Blast there. Tail Slap's going to come in. Oh, it's going to do massive damage. If it hits three times, it's dead. And it does. It hits three times. Gardevoir goes down. That is a big hit for Vin. Uh, that's one of his, his ace in the hole Pokemon against this team. Uh, just focus blast. Uh, I told him that I was like, just, just uh, if you play out Gardevoir, just keep pressing focus blast against normal. <laughs> He's like, okay. <laughs> uh, of course, it's choice scarf too, so that helps. Um, out comes Blissey, and Mawile's going to be facing up against Blissey. We'll see what he goes with here. Uh, the the Mawile's really strong. Blissey doesn't really have the best defense, so whatever he does can actually do pretty good damage. He's actually going to go with the Thunder Fang. That's pretty interesting. Maybe get the Paralyze. Uh, it's going to do more than half. Soft Boiled going to come off on the Blissey. Blissey's actually faster than the Mawile. That's uh, I don't know what Blissey's base speed is, but that's pretty interesting. Uh, Thunder Fang's going to come out and hit the Blissey again. Actually, I think this Mawile doesn't actually have a speed IV. Um, well, it has a speed IV, just not... Uh, max and uh, Thunderfang is going to keep hitting this thing and down goes Blissey so that's going to be really good for Vin he got really, uh, good, rid of a pretty good tank on that side so Pyro is going to come out he's going to go with the flamethrower uh, Vin actually stayed in. The Mawile's actually going to survive and be able to go with the Thunder Fang. Maybe go get the, paralys the Paralysis. Nope. Uh, but he's going to go with the Sucker Punch. And the Sucker Punch is actually going to be able to take out the Pyro. Maybe go with the Sucker Punch first time. Uh, but Vin played that risky and actually went down the three life. So out comes the Smeargle. Uh, not really sure what this thing does. Oh, Water Shuriken. What an interesting move to be running on on a Smeargle. So that's going to hit once, going to hit twice. Let's do two damage. It's going to need to hit four times, three times. Oh, and it gets the four times. Down goes Mawile. Pretty interesting. Uh, pretty interesting set on that with the, the Water Shuriken. So Mawile's dead. He's going to go out with Big Belly. Of course, is is my Slurpuff. You've seen this thing in videos before. He's going to withdraw the, the Smeargle there. Uh, he's going to like that. Wigglytuff's going to come out. This is a bold... Uh, this is a bold a Slurpuff, so Slurpuff's going to be very, very happy with that. He's going to go with the Belly Drum. He's going to be able to eat up any of the special attacks that this thing has. The Flamethrower is the main one that we know. Oh, he actually has Hyper Voice, and uh, Big Belly's going to be able to eat that up. He's going to eat his berry. He's going to be very, very happy here. Um, like I said, he's bold. I have Big Belly being bold. And Slurpuff has a pretty good special defense as it is, so uh, that's going to be in Vin's favor. So he's going to put out Chinchino. Of course, the Unburden doubled Big Belly speed, so now he's probably going to be faster than everything on the other team. He's plus six attack. Uh, I could see this being a GG here. So out comes Smeargle. Smeargle's not going to do anything. Uh, probably has the Focus Sash, though. Uh, Water Shuriken's going to come out, actually. Uh, Smeargle doesn't have the best attack yet. Going to do two damage per hit. So, uh, yeah, Big Belly's not going to die to this. Oh, critical hit. I actually did four. So, <laughs> I don't know. Big Belly might go down here. Oh, wow. Hit four times. Look at the Smeargle go. 
he hit eight times with water shuriken so the big belly's gonna go with it and oh actually smeargle's not running the focus sash that's pretty interesting uh, you don't often see that but brandon's actually gonna lose so that was a really quick battle of course the big belly ended up with the sweep brandon couldn't do anything to stop that um as soon as he gets going the mawile was really strong against the team too surviving that flamethrower but uh good try brandon uh, and congratulations to Vin and uh, hope to see you guys both in the next round so um, yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you guys rate subscribe comment and I will see you guys later